Hi, Tom. It's good to see you again. Um, tell us about that performance today. Uh, I'm a bit disappointed because I think we, we could have performed uh, even better, especially the first half. Um, I think actually we started fantastic the first whatever five minutes or something like that uh, i felt that united um, they were more on, on top of the game um without creating chance after chance um they had one one top moment uh, for the one nil goal uh so so of course cre credit to them for that situation but we still need to do better we, we, are, we are three against one in the box so that that should be possible uh, to to avoid that uh besides that they have a chance to match us so they didn't really create much but i know they were a bit on the ball um the first half um i felt that we lacked to be brave enough in the high pressure to go when we went we should go all the way and be aggressive uh, and we should be more cool in the ball um in spells you know we were too how can you say hectic um in, in spells but okay um fair play to man united i think they they hit a very high performance first half some of the better performance that that i've seen uh, so far so so they did well uh, second half much more the brentford team uh, i want to see uh, much more front-footed uh, better on the ball moved the ball better uh, played more forward got it to the sides for the switches produced crosses uh, and we had momentum i would say with with chances half chances um and definitely on top of the game and then we make a, a stupid mistake for the penalty an unnecessary mistake uh, um, that of course killed the game off. Um, I would say, stay in the game. Made another. I should, you know, if you, you want to win here at Old Trafford, we can't make that penalty and we can't concede on a set piece. Um, so better second half. Um, yeah. So you mentioned there about that stupid penalty for Ziyech. Obviously that was Rico Henry that did that. He had a quite a good game going forward. But obviously things didn't go his way. Yeah. But in terms of his defensive work, it wasn't that great. It's like that. So how would you feel like? No, I, I think I think Rico as a left wing back or a left full back, I think he's he's from my perspective one of the best defensive uh, fullbacks in this this season. I don't 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 think I've seen a a player going past him in a in a one v one situation. Um, when they when they were fronting against him, uh, and I think he is normally very good defending. So he made a mistake. It is what it is. He he will learn from that. Um, clever clever play by by Ronaldo. There is penalty. You know, not not saying anything against that. Obviously, um, so last year I just wanted to mention about Christian Eriksen. Obviously, apart from that kind of subpar performance, he was a real bright spark. Obviously, he created a number of chances for Tony or Guermo. How do you feel like he played amongst that? Uh, I think I think again uh, um, um, a good performance uh, consistently perform well. Um, I love the the touch from the Man United fans um, uh, for for the two corner corners one each side where they they applauded him. Um, I think that's very very good. Um, yeah, yeah, he performed well. Thank you very much, Thomas. Uh, obviously, Ivan Tony has had a great season, his first season in the Premier League. Um, but the two chances he has to score that first they had in the first half and then the scuff. Bowling the second half, I think he should have done better there. Someone like you. Um, knowing him, I know he'll be disappointed uh, at himself. You know, he had three good opportunities um, where he could have scored. Uh, maybe not three goals. Maybe not a little bit too much to ask for, but but at least one. Um, and we know in in a game like this, the, the, these moments we we need to take. Um, um, but but we couldn't tonight. And about Eric, how confident are you to, to keep him? Because he showed again tonight that he can mix with the very best. Mm. I'm uh, I'm always positive. I always believe that we we have a very good chance. I know he's very happy here. I know he's enjoying his football. Um, he loves staying at at, at Brentford. Um, but it will be a decision that we'll be taking, I guess, in the in the end of this season. Um, sorry, Thomas. Just on that, you, you obviously spoke to Christian a lot to get him to Brentford in the first place. There's clearly communication between you. How, how does that work? Because it, you've given him the stage to come back and play, and we all know how good a player he is. How, do you, how does that communication work about what he is going to do? Yeah, I think it's very simple. I speak to him. <laughs> uh, Phil Giles, the sports director, speak to him. Um, we are, um, how can I say, presenting our plans, and um, then we discuss it back and forth. And and then I think it's it's very simple. They'll made a decision in the end of the season. Uh, hi Thomas, um, commiseration on the result. I just wanted to ask. It felt like um, the team had a little bit of um, difficulty playing out the ball from the back, especially in the first half. Um, seemed to get. Um, 
seem to be giving it away inside your own art quite a lot. Why do you think that was the case? Good question. Um, I felt there was a few times when we defended low and we won the ball and we were not good enough to take care of it, to find those two, three safe passes and then, then progress up the pitch. I think uh, building up from behind, I think we did it uh, okay. Um, okay pressure from United, but I felt that we in spells didn't have the, the composure or the qualities right. I think David normally he's a playmaker uh, down there. He, he you know, also you know missed a, a couple of balls, so maybe we just didn't hit the highest level today. Um, but I got caught up with long balls over the top of a couple of times. Yeah, we, we did, sorry. Yeah, 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 with, yeah. With Ronaldo in, I yeah. think, in the first couple of minutes so yeah. Hernandez in the second half yeah. again what, that doesn't normally seem to happen what, what no. kind of yeah uh, to, to be fair I think that's also disappointing <laughs> I think it's the thing we, we normally have been really good dealing with in, in, in general defending so so I would say today we we definitely um, uh, how can I say learn to be even more aware uh, on, on, on these balls and, and we, we should have done better in, in some situa- situation and I would say when you look at our normal defensive standards normally you're better than this and then um, also just you know you mentioned about having chances and half chances um, Brentford had 24 touches in the opposition box and Man United only had 14 what do you think is kind of the, the reason why you weren't able to kind of convert all those, those touches into, into a goal I think it's a it's a it's a very good stat to show that we throughout the game attacked um, and and uh, you know really had an intention to go here to do what we can could to win. Um, unfortunately, we know that those goals that change momentum, uh, unfortunately they they drop for for United. I think if they didn't get the penalty, I, I had a feeling that there was we were a, a bit closer to to get something out of this game. Um, final question for me: um, conceded six goals in the two games you played Manchester United this season. I don't know how much you you kind of like relish these these games and a chance to, to come up against teams like this. Is that, that quite frustrating that not been able to perform better in these moments? Um, I would say that, in fact, not similar. I think the first game, I think we, I think they scored after around 60 minutes. Uh, before that, they did, didn't have a, almost a shot uh, and we defended fantastic. What we lacked in that game, and I, uh, as I said, I think we did very good the first 60, but after that, we need to keep the discipline, we need to keep still uh, being unbelievable focused and don't give them the next two goals, which we did in the first game. Here, I think, I, I felt that we kept the discipline, we did more, but we made a, a, a big mistake um, for, for the second goal. Anything else? We'll leave it there then. Thank you very much, everybody. Good, take care. Thank you.